So now let's look at a practical demonstration of Amazon Macy. So Amazon Macy is a security service that uses machine learning to automatically discover, classify and protect sensitive data in AWS. So with Amazon Macy, it can monitor your S3 buckets and notify you if it finds any PII data in it. So Amazon Macy recognizes sensitive data such as personal identifiable information, PII or intellectual property and provides you with dashboards and alerts that gives visibility into how this data has been accessed or moved. So AWS Macy or Amazon Macy is a fully managed service. So it continuously monitors data access activity for anomalies and generates detailed alerts when it detects risk of unauthorized access or inadvertent data leaks. So Amazon Macy is available right now to protect a data stored in Amazon S3 and then later on AWS is planning to add additional services. So let's look at a practical demonstration of Amazon Macy. So let's say you have some PII data in an S3 bucket. So let, let's see that. So I have this uh, CSV file that has some uh, social security numbers and credit card numbers and obviously they are not real with address and also we are providing some personal information and we are going to upload it to a S3 bucket and then provide the bucket to Amazon Macy and let Macy detect that the bucket has PII data or not. So I'm going to upload this to an S3 bucket. So I am inside a US East and Macy is only available in a US East 1 and Oregon US West 2. So make sure you create the bucket in either of the region. So I'm going to create a bucket. And then I'm going to upload the CSV file here that has PII data. So now this uh, CSV file is uploaded. So I'm now I'll go to Macy. So you can go to your console and search for Macy. And then it's only available in North Virginia and Oregon currently. And then here you are going to click get started. So you can view the permissions that Amazon Macy is going to use the IAM permission. So it will access CloudTrail, S3, IAM. So these are some of the permissions that Macy will use. And then you'll click on enable Macy. So it will take uh, some time for uh, Macy to be enabled, few seconds, and then we'll join back. So now uh, Macy is enabled. And what we'll do is go to integrations. And then we have to select the account. So in our case, I'm going to select the only account that I have. And then click on add. So we are going to add our S3 bucket over here. That has the data and then click on add over here. And over here we are going to click on review and then click on start classification and done. So now uh, we'll go to our dashboard and then we'll let Macy uh, analyze the data and collect the data and join back after let's say five minutes. So after a while, like after almost 10, 15 minutes, the dashboard was populated. So you see over here, we have 490 total number of events that occurred. So as a part of securing data, Macy analyzes and processes events or API calls logged by AWS CloudTrail that occur within your infrastructure. This metric provides the total count of all of the event occurrences monitored by Macy that took place within your infrastructure since you enabled Macy. So this is your cloud trail events that Macy is monitoring and the total user session. So a user session is a five minute aggregate of cloud trail data. This metric provides the total count of all user sessions of cloud trail data that Macy analyzed and processed since it was enabled. 
So let's look at this events. So when I click on that, now it shows cloud trail events, but what we are in interested in S3 objects. So I'm going to click search over here. And you see over here, um, Macy was able to detect that the, there are PII artifacts, namely it found address, a credit card number and email. And if you scroll further down, it will show you the file in which all this data was found. So we can click on this. So it won't show you the actual file, but it will show you the details about the file. Like, um, what did it found? So it found 15 dis distinct addresses, uh, 24 distinct full names, uh, 30 distinct credit card numbers, 30 distinct email addresses. So it was able to detect the PII data that was in the bucket. So this is what you can use Amazon Macy for.